So my three-year-old thinks I've won a dance competition to be up here. <laughs> But I'm a bit of a storyteller, so to put myself at ease, I'm going to put myself in my natural spot and tell a story. I decided to go to grad school at the uh, encouragement, let's say, of my husband, who I definitely could not have done any of this without his support um, and my lovely family as well. But we were talking, and I wasn't really happy with what I was doing. And he goes, you know, you should think about going back to school. I said, well, we, we can't afford to send me back to school right now. He's like, no, no, no. If you do it right, they will pay you to go back to school. And I had never heard of teaching assistantships or research assistantships or anything like that. And I found out that this was in fact the case. And what a wonderful college to be able to have those kind of opportunities for students. Because I don't think I probably would have came back to school without that kind of assistance. So I, I'm just so thankful. My, my interview went something like this. So Sarah. And this is after I've been out, out of my bachelor's degree for about three years. Sarah, you know, your GPA as, as a bachelor's um, candidate looked really fantastic. And I can tell that you did your GRE about three years after you graduated, because you start to kind of forget some of those, those other things and, you know, when you're working for your real job. And I think, well, yes, that, that is the case. And I was so fortunate that Ron Valero, the, the grad assistant coordinator at the time, allowed me very graciously to come in and to kind of take a test run as a grad student, which blossomed into becoming a research assistant and a teaching assistant and then a pioneer fellow. Um, it was an amazing opportunity, and I think I am a plant breeder completely by very happy accident, and the opportunities and the coaching that I got through the College of Aces. Um, being up here is a little unreal. Um, I, I, as you mentioned, you, you don't feel like maybe you've got, got everything that it took to get this, but you're here somehow. And I'm only here because of the wonderful support network that is offered by the College of Aces. It is really such a fantastical family to be a part of. And I, I can try as much as possible, and I think I can achieve fiscally repaying my gratitude but I don't know if I will ever be able to truly repay the amount of emotional and support gratitude that I feel for the organization. So thank you all very much.